What's up, everyone? Welcome to Union Gaming. This is your host, Roz. As always, like the video, share the video, and subscribe to the channel. You can find me on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Patreon, all at Ionian Gaming. Um, this video is going to be a lot of me grinding. I'm sorry. I know I didn't want to do a lot of grinding videos, but I have some things I need to say. And honestly, I can't concentrate on important things that I'm talking about um, while I'm working on new stuff in the game. So here it goes. Um, I got some... I've talked about this a little bit in earlier videos, but I've gotten some kind of bad news uh, recently. lack of a better term. I'm going to discuss it here because this might be uh, my moment to talk about it, maybe bring some attention to it. Uh, a problem that I'm having. So, back in September of last year, uh, I was diagnosed with COVID. And that's you know, we're in pandemic America right now, guys, so it's not really anything that, you know, almost everybody has had it at this point. So, but anyway, I want to talk about where the bad news is coming from here. I do apologize for some of the shit that I'm going to be talking about here, but, uh, oh yeah, I didn't throw my normal disclaimer that this video is probably not meant for young children, so if you're easily offended by adult language content, turn the video off, but anyway, but anywho, uh, after I had COVID, I noticed some things were going on in my life. And I talked I talked about this a little bit. Some of it being uh, my memory loss. And this is actually kind of fairly difficult for me to talk about, so. Uh, <laughs> so bear with me on it. Okay, guys. Some of the things that I've noticed with my memory loss, it started off small, okay? Um, and it's weird that I remember this. Like, I remember w exactly what it is that I forgot. Um, shortly after, again, I was uh, driving along and I heard a song on the radio. And the song freaking was awesome. It was playing on a local radio station, uh, a rock station that I listen to pretty much every day. And I couldn't believe I had never heard the song before. So I got my app out as far as trying to find out who sings the song. And it turns out it was Queen. Now, and it was the song I wanted all. Now, I have been a Queen fan since, I want to say, 1991-ish or 90. Right when Wayne's World came out and I was introduced to Bohemian Rhapsody for the first time. I want to actually go farther back to that. The first... I was probably a Queen fan back in 85. I just didn't really get into them as much as I did after Wayne's World. And the fact that I can remember this shit is very impressive. And there was a professional wrestler, Junkyard Dog. He used to come to the ring to the song Another One Bites the Dust. Uh, and then an Iron Eagle, another, a 
amazing 80s movie. There was a song called One Vision, which I love the Iron Eagle soundtrack. And the fact that I can remember this stuff is really pissing me off. Like, because this is not stuff that matters in real life. But the song, I Want It All, uh, no joke, I have probably heard it easily a hundred times in my life. Easily. Possibly, possibly more, probably more. Never heard the song before. Okay? Um, I was forgetting things here and there. Wasn't, it wasn't anything I could, I couldn't work around. Back in about four weeks ago, um, I got COVID again. This time, the memory loss is a lot more severe. It's not just songs now. I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting shit that I should not forget. Um, I work at a retail store. Uh, I have enough good sense not to mention which retail store it is. But, you know, my personal friends and family know which one it is. Um, I am a manager with this company, and it is a major retail chain. The, uh, and again, minor things here and there that, you know, I'm forgetting. My boss will give me notes or something, and I won't remember. I won't remember the answer to the question he's asking me. I won't remember uh, him giving me direction. I, I've read emails four or five times for my boss and then went out to do it and then completely forgot about what it was I was fucking doing. Uh, earlier this week, I was doing, um, I was opening up registers, and I opened up one register, and then I went to open up the next one, and I couldn't remember my register numbers. These are things I use frequently, okay? So this is not something that I should have forgotten. Um, there's been other moments that I have forgotten things too, but the register numbers really, really were, uh, an eye-opening thing that, hey, you should, uh, maybe go get this checked out. which I did yesterday. And they suggest that I go get checked out in person. I did a telemed doctor's visit and they want me to get checked out by <coughs> my primary care provider, which I had to go find a new one because I forgot my, I've been using telemed for the last couple of years because one, it's almost impossible to get into a doctor's office right now with COVID in a reasonable amount of time. But anyway, they recommended that I get into to see my primary care provider. I had to find a new primary care provider because I forgot that my primary care provider, a doctor that I saw up until a couple of years ago for everything until I started using telemed or whatever you want to call it. It's not actually telemed, but it's, it's an online doctor. 
I had forgot my primary care provider passed away. That's concerning too. Um, so anyway, here's where we're at. I am currently waiting to see a new primary care provider to find out what exactly is going on in my melon. A lot of things that I have read about this. God, I'm only hitting one button for the most part here. Anyhow. Um, is that this is most likely a symptom of long COVID. Which isn't a shock. But it's getting a lot worse as far as memory loss goes. Um, it's no, not just losing songs and forgetting random shit. It's now I'm forgetting important shit. I don't remember what we had for dinner yesterday. Um, I get super freaking hungry at times, and I don't know if I've remembered to eat or not. I was super hungry this morning, and I got really, really excited because apparently I have leftover Chinese in my fridge. Don't remember getting Chinese. Uh, so yeah. Uh, long story short, guys. Uh, which I'm sure I've probably already fucking said that a couple of times. Um, things aren't going great for me right now. I'm going to continue to try to pump out videos uh, since you know I can't work for well I'm not going to be going to work for a few weeks I don't feel that it's a good idea for me in my position to go to a place where I would be responsible for making decisions about people uh, business and I just don't feel comfortable doing it. I do want to say that I do work for a fantastic company though. Uh, I talked to my boss today and as he said, take care of yourself. You know, you're, uh, this place will still be here one way or another. My mental health and my life are more important than brown boxes. So I am very thankful for everything that is being afforded to me right now with everything that's going on. But I am off work for a few weeks now. And possibly longer, depending once the doctor finds out, once they start testing. For the most part, I am pretty confident that this is uh, just a symptom of long COVID. Uh, which, I pray to God it is. I've done a lot of research on it. And some of the stuff that I've read on it is is that yeah it's most likely a symptom of long COVID I have also seen other options some of them are absolutely ludicrous some of them not so much uh, my favorite thing that I saw was it could be a side effect of syphilis, which is fucking hilarious to me, because I have no idea where I would have gotten it from. No, 
and that's not just because I my memory loss. My personal love life have been pretty much non-existent for two years now. In that sense. The things that are a little bit more concerning is it's early onset Alzheimer's or potentially um, dementia setting in too. Which could happen. Um, both things are possibilities and they are absolutely terrifying to me. So, yeah, this is where we're at with my life right now, guys. So, until I can get to the doctor and find out exactly what's going on with my life, I'm going to be sitting at home not making very many decisions in life. I, uh, I have a notepad here that I am writing down things. So I can remember what I'm doing. I have my doctor's appointments right now. Uh, I'm writing stuff down so I can actually remember if I did it or not. Because, and I am also questioning things that I've done, and I write those down because I don't know if I remember actually doing it or if I've imagined it. For the most part, I feel pretty good other than the fact that I'm irritated as fuck right now because I can't remember shit. Now, the weirdest part about this whole ordeal is I remember, I remember dumb shit. Like shit that you shouldn't remember. It's just random trivia stuff that's floating around in my head. I've been quizzing myself with certain things. I've been playing random songs like, hey, can you listen to this song and tell... <sighs> can you tell me who sings this song or stuff like that? Which, for the most part, is... It's, it's working, okay? I can still remember bits and pieces of my life. Um, not only, you know, Roz would remember. Like, I remember for a fact, and I apologize, guys, I'm going to probably smoke during this video, which is also a very off-kilter thing for me to do during a video because I don't normally do this during a video. But I'm going to anyway. Shit. What the hell? <laughs> Other things um, that are going on <laughs> with my life right now, too, are that... saying but like, okay so like there's things that only I would know and it's like it's dumb shit that I know <laughs> examples I remember that Mini Driver is the only cast member of the 2004 Phantom of the Opera who did not sing her own part that's fucking random right don't remember what I had for dinner yesterday. Uh, I had to restart and reboot my computer uh, completely today, by the way. Because... Can't remember shit. Couldn't remember my PIN number. And I don't even remember where the fucking reuse... There it is. I can't remember things. I couldn't remember my PIN to access my computer. I can't remember register numbers. I can't remember just random shit that I should be able to remember. 
And that being said, I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm pretty scared right now. It's it's actually fucking terrifying right now that when your mind starts to betray you. I'm 45 years old, guys. I am... I'm used to my body turning its back on me and saying, you can't fucking do this shit anymore. My brain, not so much. I'm sure... I'm almost positive this is long COVID symptoms, but it's, it's fucking terrifying. And I don't want to... I don't want to go too long on the whole subject, but this week earlier, too, a question was brought up about something that I was doing at work, about something that was due this week, and I explained to a co-worker that, you know, I had... There was a reason why it wasn't going to get done. I thought I explained it. Apparently I did not. It's... It's pretty bad, guys. And again, I want to say... I want to have a big shout out to my boss and employer who is, I, I don't always get along nor agree with decisions, but, you know, I don't, I don't even know what, to, what I'm saying at this point. I, with that being said, I know I'm repeating myself here. I should probably have scripted this out. I'm just kind of going off the cuff with a lot of this stuff. But I'm going to try to pump out more videos. And something that I really... I'm going to finish this game probably in the next day or two. But I definitely am going to finish something that I meant to do a long time ago. It was basically the genesis of this channel. Something that I want to do as a legacy. And I am going to complete Super Mario World in the next three weeks. God fucking help me on that. It's something I have to do. I said it a while ago that I wanted to do it as a legacy to my son, and I have to. So, After I do this, I'm going to do it. I'm just, I don't know. I hope you guys, uh, the best of, I hope you guys have good days. I'm sorry for bringing you down in this video, but it is what it is right now at this point, and I'm, I apologize, but now if I don't put videos out too, don't worry. Uh, I'll try to update Twitter, but it'll be what it'll be, okay? And uh, I'm just asking that you guys uh, pray for me. Uh, hope I get through this. I really do. So, 
Until next time, guys, this is Roz signing off. I'm probably going to grind for a little while and then do some other stuff. But, yeah, that's where I'm at right now. Thanks for watching. Appreciate all the support you guys give me. Don't forget to like, share, and comment. You can find me on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Patreon, all at Eonian Gaming. Until next time, guys.